Hello and welcome back to this video. So in this video lecture, we are going to learn the pointer to data member and point, pointer to member function. Uh, before you know uh, elaborating that concept, let's uh, take a very simple example of a pointer to a data and pointer to a function. Uh, to illustrate that concept, I'm going to declare one global variable x that is equal to some 88 and I'm going to declare a function with the name fun and uh, I'm going to put some instruction inside it. This is fun function. Okay, so now inside a main, I'm going to declare uh, int star p so this is a normal point which is pointing to some integer data so i'm going to pass p equals to ampersand x and with this i'm going to write c out star p i'm expecting 88 as an output so this thing we already did in the previous uh, videos so now let's declare a pointer to a function so this is my function uh, you have pointer to a function is similar to this but instead of function name i'm going to declare a pointer star um, fun p okay. so this is my pointer okay so now i'm going to give funp function pointer uh, address of fun that is equal to a few n uh, that would be the address of a few n fine okay so now uh, let's call this function uh, that would be uh, sorry star a few n p so i'm calling this function through the pointer so this is my pointer i'm calling that thing okay let's execute this and let's see okay so here we are having a little bit problem uh, but it says the assignment of a white star white star to be white star argument mm -hmm. it should be white phone p that is going to be equals to your fun mm. did i make some mistake over here fun star fun p okay so this is okay so that is some syntactical mistake so that, sh that should be like this uh, and that should be percent let's compile this okay um fun p star fun p okay so that is the associativity of your star okay so now let's execute this and now okay done so uh, we are done with the both of the pointers so this is the syntax a little bit uh, creepy syntax uh, in a first go but uh, as you practice that would be more easy so now let's uh, you know elaborate this concept uh, to the data member and the member function so i'm going to convert this to the uh, pointer to data member so i'm going to declare a class for this uh, my class name would be a and i'm going to enclose these two uh, things uh, data member and member function over here and i'm going to declare it in a public access specifier so that i can assess these two from the main okay so i'm going to you know change this pointer uh, to like uh, a colon colon so now this pointer is not a normal pointer this pointer is going to point to a member uh, data member of a class a okay so here x is norm not a normal variable so that belongs to the class x so it's 
which index should be like this uh, okay fine okay so I have to you know convert this function e1 to you know, like uh, this that would be uh, a little bit wrong so your star would be here so this is a pointer now okay why this one uh, ampersand again this function belongs to the a uh, class a uh, okay let's uh, try our program let's see okay so it says that uh, okay so this point uh, is for the a okay p is not a member of uh, a oh I forgot to uh, declare an object over here. Uh, so my class name is A, A, O, B, J. Uh, okay. So, and one more thing, you can't do this thing uh, in the class. Uh, so this is just a pattern. So I'm going to declare one more function like initialization or input. Uh, so in an input, I'm going to initialize x, x equal to uh, let's suppose a I'm going to pass a as a formal argument over here and uh, here with the object uh, o p uh, obj uh, dot input and here I'm going to give some value like 100 I initialize a to be 100 to the object test uh, this is my pointer okay uh, okay whenever I have to call this pointer not with the class name but with the object name i'm going to call it obj dot uh, star p it should be star p fine uh, so first i have to initialize okay i have initialized so this is assess and uh, in a function call uh, that should be again obj dot function call Okay, let's uh, execute this. Okay, voila. Now we are done with this. So, uh, in this video lecture, we just learned how to declare a pointer to a normal uh, data and uh, then a pointer to a function. Then, uh, how you know, elaborate that concept to the pointer to the data member and pointer to the member function. So, now you can see that uh, this 100 is assessed uh, by the uh, pointer to data member, and then this is. Uh, this text is from the pointer to member function. Okay, thanks uh, for watching this video and uh, subscribe to you, my YouTube uh, channel. Uh, subscribe, subscribe to my YouTube channel for the more update and new videos. Thanks for watching.